What's up guys, I'm Moon Man here. And uh, today you can tell by the title of the video, we're gonna be unboxing the November 2022 Pro Wrestling Crate, the mystery box. It's a monthly subscription by Pro Wrestling Tees. It's my first one. And uh, it guarantees two t-shirts um, and usually some kind of toy and then a bunch of just randomness. So um, yeah, let's just go ahead and let's Let's open it. All right, make sure I show you guys first. I know inside here in this box, there's supposed to be a cheat sheet that shows stuff in there, and then it tells you what might be in the next uh, the next box. So I'm gonna go ahead and just move that over there. All right, and we'll do one thing first. We'll do one of the t-shirts first, then we'll do another one last. Okay, and I'll show you guys first because I don't know what's in there. Let's see. Is it cool? Well, I like it see what it is it is the acclaim that's pretty cool it's pretty neat uh, I'm not really a fan but uh, I might keep it I like the purple it's pretty cool uh, let's go for something a little different this time I think this what is this I have an idea of who this is supposed to be but I'll just wait and see the cheat sheet but it's like a it's like a keychain. You see that? The light I know is a little bit rough on it. That's pretty neat. Let's see. Here's something else. It feels like a sticker or something. Yeah, it is an Evil Uno sticker. Evil Uno. Again, not really much of a fan of Evil Uno, but he is becoming increasingly more popular as time goes by, which is pretty neat. There's something else small. Let's try that. Okay, this one is actually really cool. It's a uh, John Moxley enamel pin. I think it'll fit real good in the hat. Um, you guys remember him as Dean Ambrose from WWE, John Moxley now here in, um, in AEW, and he also was in, uh, has wrestled in Game Changer Wrestling and various other promotions. And uh, he's one of the big names right now. That's pretty cool, I'm a fan of that. All right, next. They do these little things called micro brawlers. It's like these really small, like toys that are collectible, and there's like a two, there's like multiple variations if you get the regular or the other kinds. And uh, they, the cost of them, the price of them is like the same price as the whole box. Um, also, to mention, everything in the box is only exclusive to the box. So like you can't get it anywhere else unless someone just sells it off of eBay or something. But let's go ahead. I'll show you guys first. And I can see what it is on the back. And this one's really cool. It is Double J Jeff Jarrett, and you guys, if you guys uh, been watching recently, he recently made an appearance on AEW, so he's still he's still out there doing his thing. I remember him more from TNA. Also, remember one of my favorite moments is when Beetlejuice, my favorite celebrity ever, called him Slap Nuts, and then um, Jeff hit Beetlejuice over the head with a guitar and knocked him out. That was awesome. One of the greatest moments in pro wrestling, if you ask me. So yeah, that's cool. I'll be hanging on to this one. I really like this one. Okay, I think it's time for another t-shirt, so. Okay, I can see it's purple. I'll try to go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. I got all these in Excel, so let's see what this is. Okay, this is uh, the bad guy, Scott Hall, a.k.a. Razor Ramon. Uh, you guys know he, he passed away earlier this year. Uh, he was... Uh, actually supposed to do multiple appearances in my hometown because they always kept getting um, canceled due to like health reasons um, and it never ended up happening so I never got to meet him but uh, he's one of the all-time greats um, you know one of the best that never really was the world champion I uh, definitely remember from NWO um, you know both the WCW WWF it's just this is one that I'll personally wear and I'll personally keep. So uh, this right here is probably the value of the whole box there, which the box retails for like 20 something dollars a month plus tax. Okay, and then I think there's only a few more things left here. So, okay, this is a Tales from the Road, a Tales from the Road um, magazine. And if you can't tell all in the front already, this is iconic now. It just happened recently. This is Joey Janela. So, which he makes a lot of appearances. He's, he's really big in the deathmatch wrestling scene. And I, I'm, a, I'm a pretty big fan of his. And yeah, it just details like different stuff from uh, 
every time they do one of these, it's just a different wrestler and different stuff that they did like while they're on the road just tells that they you know give a story and they make it to a comic book which is pretty cool if you ask me so yeah it says that these this story here is uh, Joey Janela and Michael Kingston whenever um, Joey Janela lit his foot on fire and uh, super kicked him uh, it was not even that long ago so uh, it's probably worth looking it up if you haven't already seen that because it's pretty cool and like on the back you should look that up too he got like a piece of uh, wood stuck through his whole chin and he pulled it out it was awesome all right, I think we're at the very last thing, which is an exclusive autograph. So I already know who all is supposed to be in the box, and I was already hoping this guy would be the autograph. So I'm pretty excited about it, and I'm hoping, there's something I'm hoping, but if it's not that, I'll tell you. really cool he's also known as Akeem and it said one man gang slash Akeem on what could be in the box so um, I was wondering if it was gonna be him or Akeem like as the thing I was hoping it would be the autograph uh, and I got the one man gang variant um, first time I ever saw one man gang was I was re-watching the, uh, the first Royal Rumble he was the last person eliminated by Jim Duggan um, yeah it's really cool I've never met him but he's still around uh, I would really love to meet him, uh, and I don't know why it said ha like Flash Akeem. Maybe there's like another variant where you can get the Akeem autograph, him signing as Akeem. But uh, this is something I'll definitely keep. I really like this. Um, further ado, uh, let's go ahead and look and see what everything was. You had the Acclaim T-shirt, the Bad Guy Tribute Scott Hall T-shirt, the Jeff Jarrett Micro Brawler, the Joey Janela Cryptic Closet Comic Book. Uh, yeah, you can get. Yeah, okay, it's either One Man Gang or Akeem. Same guy, but different gimmick, autograph thing. So we got the One Man Gang, the John Moxley label pin, uh, the Elite Babyface Keychain. So yeah, that's who I thought we were getting here. And then an Evil Uno sticker. And then, like I said, it gives you a, a spoiler alert for the next box. And here is what it says you might see. Hangman Adam Page, Mick Foley, Ray Phoenix, Penta L Zero, um, Killer Cross, Ultimo Dragon, Scarlet Bordeaux, and the major in the major wrestling figure podcast. So that's pretty neat. So uh, be on the lookout for that one next month. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, share, Moon Man.